Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Today we will see a game between Edwin Adams with the white pieces and Carlos Ripito with the black pieces. This game uh, was played in New Orleans in 1920. We have e4, e5, knight f3 and uh, d6. Uh, white goes for d4, uh, he captures on d4, and uh, the queen captures on d4. Uh, now black played uh, knight c6, developing the knight and attacking the queen. And um, from now uh, white played um, bishop uh, b5. Uh, developing the bishop and uh, pinning the knight to the king. Uh, now black played uh, uh, bishop uh, d7 and uh, white captures the knight on c6. Black captures back with the bishop and uh, white played knight c3, developing the other knight. From now, uh, black played knight f6 and uh, white castles. Uh, now, black played uh, bishop e7, allowing a castle kingside. And uh, now, uh, white played uh, knight uh, b5, attacking the knight on uh, f6 uh, and here um, black captured with uh, the bishop instead of uh, capturing with the knight and um, white captures the bishop with the pawn on uh, d5 black castles and um, white played uh, bishop g5 Now black played um, c6 and um, white goes for c4. Black captures on d5 and uh, white captures back with the pawn, uh, of course, on uh, d5. Now black played rook e8, uh, defending the bishop, and also uh, white uh, played uh, um, rook uh, f e1, attacking the bishop. Now black played uh, a5. And uh, here uh, white played rook e2 and the idea of white is to um, double the rooks on the e file and putting pressure on uh, this file of course. Uh, now uh, black played uh, rook uh, um, c8 and uh, white played uh, rook a1 uh, putting pressure um, on uh, this uh, file and uh, now black uh, played um, queen um, d7 uh, so allowing the communication between uh, the rooks and the bishop captures on uh, f6 and, uh, and then uh, the bishop captures back on f6 and from now we can see that uh, the white queen is uh, under attack uh, by the bishop and uh, here um, White played this um, this move um, that looks like uh, 
uh, a blunder, but it isn't. Uh, the move is uh, queen uh, g4. Why this move? Because if uh, the queen captures uh, the white queen, then will be made in a few moves because after capturing uh, this rook the other rook captures back and then that will be a back rank uh, checkmate so for uh, this reason after queen g4 uh, black played um, queen uh, e5 and uh, now uh, white uh, tries uh, the um, same uh, thing uh, of uh, uh, the previous move uh, by moving uh, the queen to c4 and uh, from now even if uh, uh, black captures with uh, the queen or uh, the rook uh, that will be checkmate in any case because if he captures with uh, uh, the rook after some captures and uh, that's the checkmate and if, if uh, the captures with uh, uh, the queen again that's a uh, checkmate with uh, um, the same tactic of the reflection so from now um, after queen c4 uh, black uh, um, goes back to uh, d7 and uh, here um, white played uh, queen uh, c7 and so uh, we can see that uh, white is uh, doing the same tactic um, to checkmate black and from now uh, Black played uh, um, queen uh, e5, white played uh, um, a4, so attracting the queen to a4. So after capturing, black played um, rook uh, e4, uh, of course. Uh, um, Black played uh, queen b5, and uh, here uh, if he takes the rook, that uh, after the same tactic, that's uh, always checkmate. So after uh, queen b5, um, white captures on b7. And uh, here, um, black resigns.